Okay, so just going to try to do a few really quick reviews uh, for the first two episodes of NCIS, season eight. Eight already, guys. Okay, so the first episode was Spider and the Fly. People either loved it or hated it. There was a lot of good reviews that I had read, you know, NCIS is back, you know, they had Daddy Gibbs in there, there was ass kicking, awesome. But there was also some negative reviews because of, um, I think it was just basically Gibbs' moral compass. And it did bother me a bit, because I, when Alejandro shot his sister, spoiler, oh, I felt bad for them. And you're not supposed to feel bad for the bad guys. They're the bad guys. And they're two-dimensional villains and whatever and but like I felt bad I was like that guy just killed his sister you know like and yes they put friggin skeletons on Ducky and Abby's cars and they tried to kill Pa Watson and they were drug dealers and they've obviously done a lot of horrible things but to think that they're not gonna go after Gibbs after what he did to their father even though their father was a bad guy it's just vengeance breeds vengeance it just goes back and forth and I'm not gonna like stop watching the show altogether but uh, just something to think about, I guess. So as an episode, I would, I would give it, I have a rating system, 1 to 5, for you, those of you who don't know, which is like anyone who watches this. Um, so out of scale of 1 star to 5 stars, 5 stars being, of course, the best, I'm going to give this one about a 3.5. Because it was very good. It was very interesting. So it was, it was a good episode, it was just all the, the whole... I don't think that they constructed it as best as they could have. I think one very simple thing they could have done to actually make the whole thing okay for me was that there was two NCIS, NCIS agents that were guarding Daddy Gibbs. And one of them died and one of them was injured. If you had just, the guy that died, if you had given him like a name or a face or just cast him and then he died, I think that would have been enough for me to kind of get over the whole I feel bad for them because here's this guy and you know, it's not just like Abby and Ducky being threatened or Daddy Gibbs being, you know, his shot, his shot being shot up, it's, you know, someone had actually died, not just, you know, there's a difference between killing someone and attempting to kill someone. It's not a big difference, but it's still a difference. That's just my opinion. 